Hey guys, welcome to Walkthrough Wednesday. My name is Jason Keller. I'm a sales guy here from Walnut Ridge. Just going to give you a quick tour of the 318 BR. It's made by Keystone Hideout. So this coach actually has a power tongue jack. So if you don't like doing the old crank style, really cool, easy to level the coach out from the tongue jack here. Um, now, another, one of my favorite features on this coach is it has, it's, it's actually pre-wired for the side marker cameras. Really cool feature. Um, so you can see around those sides and even if you don't have your trailer mirrors, I would recommend having the trailer mirrors though. So great big pass through storage, power stabilizing jacks, cool features so you don't even have to bring a drill with you. Solid steps, these guys fold into the coach, we'll go back in and check out the coach here in a minute. Great big power awning, huge, tons of shade, pow outdoor speakers, indoor speakers, and a really cool LED uh, light strip. My favorite part, the outdoor kitchen. Two burner stove, nice little fridge here, plenty of extra space. Oh, and styrofoam. And extra cabinetry in the back. Now this coach is pre-wired for a backup camera in the rear, and you do have the rear bumper for a bike rack. So, good stuff. Let's go inside. I'm gonna start here in the bedroom. So you do have a really cool laundry chute. It actually drops into to the uh, pass-through storage underneath. Really cool feature. And then you have hanging lockers, one on each side, plenty of hanging clothes space there. And then you even have under the bed storage. A cool feature for this, if you have kiddos, you have pocket doors. So you can separate, well, it's actually still a latch chair, but you can actually separate yourself from the kiddos and <laughs> if you wanted to, you have some privacy. Heat ducts in the floor and you have ducted AC. So even if these are closed, you're still gonna stay cool and warm if you need to. Um, on this back wall, because of the pocket doors, they put the, C the TV bracket on the side wall. So um, you do have to kind of, I put it on a swivel mount there. You also have the living room um, TV bracket here. Nice electric fireplace and on uh, cold mornings, this thing you just turn it on, it's electric, doesn't draw from your propane, so saves that. Um, and this is obviously satellite, pr uh, satellite prepped. Um, <clears throat> plenty of kitchen space, plenty of cabinet space. And you even have this cool road back, road back um, central back system, very cool. And a 12 volt fridge. So you don't have a propane electric fridge in this coach. You have a huge 12 volt fridge. So we're about two, two and a half hours south of Elkhart. And by the time we get these guys, sometimes they already have ice in the freezer. So they will work off the truck battery, cool feature. Um, you do have the jackknife sofa with storage underneath. Anywhere you get extra storage, it's always helpful. Booth dinette, and you have storage under each side there. Plenty of extra space. And this folds down to a bed, that folds down to a bed. Great big windows, awesome feature with LED lighting. It's well lit, I know we don't have this one lit, but it is, it is quite nice. Another cool feature, huge pantry. And you have a second entrance for the kiddos if you're at the beach and you don't want the sand to go throughout the coach. Just make them come in this door. And then for the kids' master suite, bunks everywhere, cabinets everywhere. Um, you can set up a TV here and they have this cool thing. It folds out. So you actually have, you can sleep two or three kiddos here. And then this bunk actually raises up. So they're going to have more space or more playroom area actually um my in-laws they took this i think they had something similar to this they took that out and put a uh, pack and play in there so i mean that's another feature you can do if you need to so well that is my walkthrough wednesday wednesday uh please let me know if you have any questions